The beginning of data storage dates back to antiquity, where our ancestors stored information on cave walls, then on papyrus, parchment, and paper. Let's see how data storage started and evolved. Punch cards were the first official form of data storage. These were pieces of perforated paper where the holes are 1 and the non-holes are 0, being inserted into the computer by photoelectric scanning. In 1890, Herman Hollerith invented the tabulation machine using these cards, which could read and record data up to 0.12 kilobytes. In 1951, magnetic tapes began to be used to store data on a computer. A 225 kilobyte magnetic strip could replace 1920 punch cards. In 1956, IBM invented the world's first hard drive and weighed about a ton. It had 50 24-inch disks, a rotation speed of 12,000 RPM, and could store up to 5 megabytes of data. Specifically, such a hard drive could replace 23 magnetic tapes. After that, in 1963, Philips Company released cassette tape, used mainly to store audio files. A small 90-minute tape could record approximately 0.66 megabytes of data on each side. In 1971, IBM introduced floppy disks or hard disk alternatives. At first, there were 8-inch floppy disks with a storage capacity of 0.8 megabytes, but later a smaller version of 5.25 inches appeared, which could store 1.2 megabytes. The 3.5-inch floppy disk was introduced in 1982, was the most popular, and could store 1.44 megabytes. Also in that period, 1980, Seagate released the first 5.25-inch hard drive with the same structure as today. It weighed 2.3 kilograms and could store 5 megabytes of data. In 1982, Sony and Philips released the compact disc to store information in digital format, especially audio recordings. The CD storage capacity was 700 megabytes. In 1991, SanDisk released the first commercial SSD with a storage capacity of 20 megabytes. The largest SSD is currently 100 terabytes and costs over $40,000. In 1994, iOmega introduced Zip Drive with a capacity of 100 megabytes, then 250 megabytes, and 750 megabytes. In 1995, Sony, Philips, Toshiba, and Panasonic introduced DVDs. It has a larger storage capacity than the same size CD. A DVD could store 4.7 gigabytes of multimedia data. In 1999, Panasonic, Toshiba, and SanDisk developed a 8 megabyte SD card. Back then, the SD card was used primarily to store music and photos. In 1999, M-System developed the first USB flash drive, a plug-and-play data storage device. The first USB flash had a storage capacity of 8 megabytes, gradually increasing the storage capacity even to 1 terabyte. In 2006, Dell, Hitachi, Hewlett-Packard, LG, Mitsubishi, Panasonic, Sony, and TDK developed Blu-ray Disc a high-definition data technology. A Blu-ray disc can store 25 gigabytes or 50 gigabytes of data. The concept of cloud computing really began to be discovered in 2006 when Amazon launched AWS Amazon Web Services. Google Drive is the most used cloud storage service in the world with a percentage of 94.4%, followed by Dropbox with 66.2%, and OneDrive with 39.35%. By 2025, there will be over 100 zettabytes of data storage in the cloud. If you don't know how much a zettabyte means, we have a video explaining this. You can find it in the description. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video. See you in the next video.